So I wanted to share about the eclipse tomorrow. Uh, we've got a big eclipse coming up. Um, everybody's been kind of like feeling it quite intensely. A lot of people have been feeling it. I know I have. Um, so yesterday was like quite tired, quite wiped out. But today, today's been a bad, bad, bad day. And it's really like the energy coming through me is just so powerful. Um, and it's not nice either, not good energy at all. Um, so I wanted to share and talk about my experience with what's coming up because you might liken it to something similar you're going through yourself. Um, basically woke up this morning with extreme rage, like so much anger, like really bad and <laughs> couldn't quite contain it. And I kind of think it was irritation and anger at myself. Anyway, I just want to say to those of you that may have came into contact with me this morning on school run, I apologize, <laughs> but I was I was in my feelings a lot this morning. Yeah, I, I just pff, couldn't couldn't deal with anything. Um, and the day's kind of gone like that. And then come lunchtime, um, I just started to go into this real disillusionment, hopelessness, failure, trying to start a business up, and it's just like, what's the point? And da 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 da. All of this old stuff. Yeah, it's been my stuff for a very long time, but it all kind of like was up in here. Now the important thing was that I didn't engage in it and think it's my reality, but I still allowed myself to feel it. And that's kind of like walking a bit of a tightrope, tight rope, you know? Um, so I allowed the feelings, but I didn't believe in the story. So that's the difference there. Um, and then I kind of like released a little bit of it because with me, I release it through tears. I, I can have like, I can cry and then it's out. Some people might go for a surf. There is always like some little thing that you'll take the lid off that will allow it to come out. Um, everybody's different. They might move it through exercise or you might just hold on to it for some time until you just get sick. But either way, there's a release of some sort, you know, um, and it's your choice on how quickly you want to move it through. So mine came out in tears today. And I feel so broken, I feel unwell, I feel nauseous, I feel tired. And right now, the best thing I can do is align with it. So I'm like literally come home, keeping quiet, getting under a blanket and just this too shall pass kind of thing. Um, it's very important to allow these things to come up because the way I feel, it's, it's a lot different to how it was before. It's not the same old slog because the way I feel is, yes, all, there's all this density coming up and it's not very nice and it's not very pleasant and I'm really feeling it. But what's, what I can feel is I'm feeling my stuff, but behind it, I can see the, the God's fingers, the sunlight coming through. And I know that that's my stuff. That's who I really am. And that's my reality. So I kind of like, I've got this cloud here, but I still have this blue sky. Whereas before, last year and years prior, going through this energy stuff, I couldn't see that. Just got overwhelmed with like, oh my God, this is never going to end. So the difference is, as we move through these things, we move through them a lot more efficiently. Um, and I think that that's, that's what I'm experiencing today. That I can feel this really intense stuff, but I know that, that it's not going to last for long, which means I believe that my reality is not this, my reality is the good stuff. So you will be feeling some stuff. You, If you are feeling intense emotions and things like that, you've got to just understand how to align with that and let it be. You can't get away from it. It's got to ride through you. Allow that process to happen um, and put yourself where you've got to be to, uh, to, to do that. Um, go where you can. Um, so yeah, so that's like my advice to you now. And I just wanted to share to you, with you on this day um, because I probably, I might do another one tomorrow. I don't know, but let's see what happens on the eclipse and post and then go from there. But yeah, it's an intense time, but it's also an exciting one because it's another opportunity for you to get rid of your stuff and just let it go. So like the funny Buddha picture says, let that shit go, man. Okay. Yeah. So love yourself. Be peaceful with yourself, allow, allow it, this stuff to come through because you can't repress it because if you do, it lasts longer. So what you resist persists. Um, so yeah, so let's see what the next two days bring. Um, peace.